What's up guys, it's layering season. So let's create a moment for some jacket talk. In this video, I'd like to show you three different ways and six different outfits as proof that no matter what type of work you do or lifestyle choices you may have, there's one jacket that's always a great fit. So let's get into it. Let's take a step back and think about why it is we actually wear jackets. And you're probably thinking, duh, Fola, to stay warm. Come on. Of course, of course. But hear me out. It's more than staying warm. It's an art. See, layering is super flattering because it allows you to add depth to your outfit with colors, textures, and patterns as well. And when it comes to jackets, well, there's a ton of options out there. And hey, many of them are great. But from a stylist perspective, if there's one jacket I'd be comfortable with styling any of my clients in, it's the field jacket. And here's why. Number one, it has a collar. And any item with a collar can be dressed up or dressed down. Number two, it has a belt or waist adjuster that allows you to cinch the waist for a refined tapered fit. Number three, it has snap buttons, making it easy to fasten or get in and out of the jacket quickly and without much hassle. And finally, it's pretty lightweight, which allows for a ton of layering options from light to heavy as the weather changes. Now, this is not a fitting jacket for extremely cold or freezing temperatures, but if you live in a warmer region or when the weather is hovering in the 40s to mid 60 degree range, it's absolutely a great option. For our first take, we have professional style. If you work in a formal environment like a bank or a law office, a field jacket is a perfect substitute for a blazer. For this first look, I'm going with three-piece styling using this double-breasted vest as an anchor for the outfit. It helps keeps my shirt and tie combo together and allows me to leave the jacket open. I've also chosen this off-white pair of trousers to complement the vest and the navy field jacket for some striking contrast. Tying up the belt in the back helps give this flattering waist taper I mentioned earlier. This, in my opinion, is a fail-proof look and any pair of dress shoes would work just fine. But to keep things simple, I'm sticking with my trusty black tassel loafers. Instead of rocking a vest, you could also do this with a crew neck sweater. With this outfit, the goal is keeping the whole color palette a little bit understated, hence the gray crew neck and black trousers. This helps tone down the camouflage pattern and comes together for an interesting but still work appropriate outfit. Remember, to pull this off, the secret is avoiding colorful items. To dress things up even further, you could also add some elegant accessories like this pair of readers, gold collar bar, and this vintage style wristwatch. Our second theme is business casual or semi-formal. For a more casual office, classroom, or educational setting, let's dial things back by losing the tie and picking the right colors. So here I'm pairing the same trusty denim shirt and off-white trousers and a pair of these dark brown suede loafers to balance out the trousers. I really, really love these loafers because they're super comfortable and somehow they seem to blend really well with everything. And finally, let's finish this outfit off with this moss green jacket. This one is all about color play and pairing the right tones together. So think neutrals like shades of gray, black, white, or similarly, earth tones like tan, brown, and olive. Another great example of this look would be with a pair of minimalist white sneakers. These pair well with any color of trousers, so I'm going with this olive pair and a burgundy crew neck as a base layer to complement those trousers. Everything comes together perfectly for a great smart casual look that works perfectly for the office, happy hour, lunch, or dinner date. And finally, we have casual or street style. We all have those ants to run. And I don't know about you guys, but I typically prefer not to look like a slouch. Yes, even when I'm running errands. So maybe you're visiting your local coffee shop or hanging out with friends, here's where you can get really, really creative. And as you can see, this olive field jacket pairs perfectly with denim. And then you could also add a ball cap, a t-shirt, or a turtleneck, depending on how chilly the weather is. Now, if you're a street style guy, just play with some of your stylish sneakers to switch things up. Like with this look where I've paired these set of brown cargo pants with my new Balance 650R from ALD and a navy fisherman beanie. For this outfit, I'm treating this camel field jacket as a shirt with just a tank top underneath and rolled up sleeves. And that's it, six outfits, three lifestyles, and a jacket that can handle almost anything you can throw at it, from a Windsor tie to high top sneakers. Full outfit details are linked in the description below, and if you've been wondering on how to look your best in the fall, winter, or spring, 
Hopefully this gave you a ton of ideas on how to get started without feeling the need to add a ton of pieces. Remember, less is more gents, so invest wisely in those wardrobe items. Keep styling until next time, fellas. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.